right, here we have a non-working Sega CD Model 1. We're going to show you what's wrong with it and see if we can take it apart and repair it. Okay, here's what I'm going to show you is a common problem with the Sega CD Model 1. As you can see, it is turned on. The ready light is green. The access light is blinking. This puppy is ready for a game. So we are going to put one in. We have a Mickey Mania. Hit the reset button. Send the disc in. And it just keeps spitting it right back out. And it will not read it. And there's absolutely nothing you can do to get the disc to stay in without some kind of repair. Uh, I did a little bit of research and found out that it could be multiple of issues. Um, it could be a uh, switch inside that is not activating and telling the system that the disc is in there. Or it could be the drive belt. So what we're going to do is take it apart and see... If it is indeed the drive belt, which would probably be one of the easier fixes. So let's dig in. So here we see the inside of the Sega CD. Uh, all that was needed, I didn't really film it, um, was obviously to remove the screws on the bottom side. Uh, and these two screws here on the side lift the top off. Um, there is a shield that was screwed in here that you have to take out. You pull these tabs to the side out and gently take the tray out. I also took the belt off for good measure just to check at it. Uh, the belt looks okay. I'll probably put it back in. Um, the reason that the tray wouldn't close is right there this little piece broke off right here if you could see it, it which is allowing the whole uh, laser assembly to as you can see wiggle and that's why it was spitting the tray out so what I'm going to do is glue that little tab back on there do a little minor cleaning in it put it back together and see if this thing works okay so what we've done here is we use a little uh, plastic weld and uh, put that piece back on it's uh something they're pretty good now um, nice and solid and we began to uh, reassemble uh, put the tray back in Screw this piece back down Then we're just gonna put that shield up here screw everything up and uh, Give it a shot Hopefully that did the trick you can, uh, Clean it up a little bit got some fingerprints in um, Also clean off the uh, Laser right there it doesn't seem to be um, too bad, but uh, I would rather not rip this apart again. So while we have it, we'll clean this uh, the laser off. Not that that was an issue, but just pretty up a little bit before we completely close up shop on it. And then uh, we'll hook it up and see if that fixed the problem. Hopefully that was it. Okay, we have the shielding reassembled, and now we will put the top on, screw everything back in, and give it a shot. So now the moment of truth. 
we will put a disc in and see if it works. Looks like we have success. It's reading it. And there we go. Appears to be a successful repair of the Sega CD. Not too bad.